Okay, so I was going to start the video out here on the terrace of the office, but I feel like we should probably go inside so I can do the normal intro. There's people working. Hello and welcome to the show. My name is Alex and this is Tech Flight. Hey, quickly before today's video starts, check out our office. So when I say in my head the word tech flow, I think of a lot of reminiscent things. I think of me in my old bedroom showing people how to install an LED strip on a TV. I think of companies sending me mice, computer mice, to review. I think of then getting my friend Jed to help me along with the channel still in my bedroom. I think of then us getting this office space and what it was then as you can see on screen versus what it is well now and I think that's a really 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 tricky thing to forget or look over it's really easy to look at this office space and think you know what the heck is it I mean there's big pieces of cardboard up here as you can see there's my desk which I never really, to be honest with you, actually use other than to maybe in my vlogs put a camera here and sit here. I think, I think the, actual, the only thing that actually really gets used in this room is this desk. It's the only thing that is actually functional that we actually genuinely use. And this is the edit station where we now edit our Techflow videos. Yes, we have our own desk. And this is what I'm trying to say. Techflow's come on so far to where we have now an office space which we converted from this to this there's now two of us that do this, and we have a dedicated editing space, and we even have, well, our tech flow set, and we only have one of them, but this, well, this space has been where we've shot all of our videos. We have our tripod here, we have a screen mounted to the wall here, so we can see what the camera sees on a bigger scale to make sure everything is in focus. We have our, probably the ex most expensive piece of equipment that we've ever had to sort of buy for tech flow, the, what is it? The NTG3 from Rode, which is our microphone. We've got our shoddy overhead rig. We've got our awesome IKEA lights as to which you can go ahead and change the color temperature over there. Everything really does work very, very well, but I'm gonna talk about some stats with you guys. And I think all of this really hit home, guys, when we sat down and looked at a few of the channel stats. The most incredible one being, yes, there is bigger tech channels here in the UK. We've got obviously our friend Super Saf, we've got Mr. Who's the Boss, all incredible people here in the UK, but TechFlow as a channel is viewed by UK people the most. Like TechFlow is in the UK, it's in the top 10 viewed tech channels by UK citizens, which is an absolute staggering number. And uh, we really feel like in this space right now, we are reaching our creative limit. And we want to go ahead and change a little bit of that around. With, obviously, your guys' help. Because we do this, not just us, but you guys involved as well. And alongside those awesome channel stats, we've had loads of sponsors come along. Like Intel, for example, who provided the latest Surface with the, uh, well, the 8th generation Intel Core i7 inside of it, which is, if you guys haven't noticed, allowed us to do two videos a week on TechFlow because we can work remotely outside of the office using this laptop with the uh, incredible performance as we went in the review of this on Premiere Pro, which was why we were really stoked about this, as well as the insane battery life that comes along with the 8th gen processors inside of here. So, before we had this laptop, this is exactly where Jed would sit. And he would, uh, well, he'd uh, click the start menu, he'd open up Premiere Pro, and uh, off he would go. There's two problems with that though. Number one is, uh, this setup is getting a little bit slow and a little bit old, according to Jed. Apparently we're getting a lot of render issues on the computer and it's just genuinely slow for doing two 4K videos a week, which is obviously multi-camera, as you guys would know if you're fans of tech flow. So, uh, oh, the second problem with that is that you can't finish, you you've got to be here to edit, you can't take anything with you. So, this is what we now do. We uh, turn that mouse around there, we turn around the keyboard and um, essentially, and people are gonna think I'm joking, but genuinely, this is now what Jed does. He edits on this. 
because uh, with the Intel 8th gen, it's fast enough, with Premiere Pro, with the hardware acceleration, and we can also take it with us, so Jed doesn't even have to be in the office. And bear in mind, Jed doesn't even have a key to the office, so if Jed wants to come here, I have to come and let him in, which is wasting valuable time. This thing, it's a lifesaver. And actually, because I know, uh, it seems really stupid, doesn't it, Alex? This laptop can't be more powerful than this massive, big editing computer. Come on, Alex, we're, well, we're, not, we're not transparent. Just be honest with us. Well, let me, let me show you. What I'll do here is, instead of trying to demonstrate us editing on this, because it can do that, what I'll do is try and do something even a little bit more hard, you know, on the processing power of this laptop, and uh, play some games. So, uh, sort of instead of doing some editing on this and some boring render test, I know a lot of you guys are casual gamers, so what I thought I'd do is just uh, on this Surface Book here with the, the latest 8th gen Core i7 which what they have mainly improved on these laptops is the new 8th gen Intel processors and that is allowing us to have this awesome gaming experience that I didn't even think I would be able to have on such a portable laptop. I mean here we're playing Play Unknown Battlegrounds and the laptop is doing it without a choke whatsoever. And uh, yeah, this is a pretty good gaming experience. So. Uh... Yeah, I mean, look, even going from light to dark places, it's absolutely fine. This is really fluent and a very decent gaming experience, obviously, with a, with a mouse attached um, to the laptop. So, as you guys can see, the laptop can not only game, but it can uh, definitely edit our tech flow videos, too. It has the performance, as well as being able to travel. It's like, it's like a travel machine without compromise, if that makes sense. The power of this machine, but portable. And that is what's really hit us home and driven us to make this video. So, what we want from you guys is this. We want to remake this office. We need to keep pushing TechFlow forward. And I'm sure all of you guys want to see it succeed just as much as we do, because if you're still subscribed, you're obviously enjoying the content. We try our best to bring you guys two videos every single week on TechFlow. So guys, use the comment section as your haven. Put down there a couple of things. Some videos that you guys want to see, maybe some of our older stuff, you want more top fives, but then also, and most importantly, comment down below how we can change this office to make it not only really, really nice for obviously cameras, so when we're shooting in here, we could use this down here as a set, not just up there. We want it to look awesome, we want it to be very functional, but above all, we want everything to be really, really easy. We want the place to be really well lit, we want microphones everywhere, we want cameras to hand, we want to be able to pick up and shoot, and we at most want it to inspire both Jed and I whilst we're in the office. So guys, in TechFlow today, we have sat down and drawn out the new plans for the office or something like we want it to be. So maybe a little bit of inspiration for you guys to put towards what you are gonna put in the comment section down below. We've got obviously the front door here. We want something like this, guys. We want a, a big, big desk here, which is obviously gonna be my desk and we can have my computer here and sort of abolish the breakfast bar, which we never really used. And then we have a nice big editing desk over here so obviously we can sit there with the laptops but then we can also have it as a b-roll area and it can also be a background of a set as well as my desk and then over in this corner which is at the moment just a little bit of a wasted space as you can see we've got a written down here maybe a, a b-roll area that we could possibly use to shoot b-roll for products obviously that's what tech flows all about guys so there you go that is genuinely our story on how this laptop has inspired us to, uh, to really step up our game here at TechFlow and allowed us to genuinely make two videos a week because we don't have to be in the office to edit and upload. I think, uh, Jed, not the camera if this is correct, but you uploaded a video to TechFlow whilst in the car. Yeah? On this laptop, yeah? There you go. Point proven. And guys, I know it really does just seem a little bit far-fetched. Alex, a laptop? Really? A laptop? has done this to TechFlow, and no, it's not really done this to TechFlow or inspired us, it's more just been a tool that has allowed us to go ahead and create videos when we are outside of the office, so we can hit that two upload target a week, which ever since we've had this machine, we've been trying and successfully hitting, which is really, 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 really cool. So with that being said, guys, this is the Surface with its, well, its eighth gen i7. I'm feeling big things are coming in the future. But for now, my name's been Alex. This has been TechFlow. 
catch you in the next one.